Opposition greeted Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton as he visited the Rio Grande Valley today in Harlingen. This after the politician threatened to remove the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals, better known as DACA. DACA! 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 Strength, power, and resistance. Some of the few feelings found during the protest held today by pro-immigrant activists. Chants and posters were shown in response to the statement made by Paxton to sue the government if they do not eliminate DACA by September 5th. It's important that we show up and let them know how we feel and that we interrupt his events just like he's interrupting our lives. Paxton, along with nine other Republicans, intend to file the lawsuit stating they strive to prevent any future assignations of DACA. Uh, this is a program that has benefited over 800,000 dreamers. These are people who have come into the U.S. when they were one month, two months, one year, three years, at a very, very young age, who have no criminal background. Uh, who are being screened by the Department of Homeland Security. Two senators, one from South Carolina and another from Illinois, brought forth a new version of the DREAM Act with the purpose to provide a more secure future for DREAMers. Now, opponents of DACA say they want to reform the immigration process rather than keep the Obama-era executive order. The proposition to remove DACA has not yet been approved, but we will keep you updated with the results on September 5th. Reporting for Fox News, Idania Ramirez.